This is NDTV. And you're watching NDTV Prime. In association with Micromax. Nothing like anything. of comedy i'm akriti tyagi mention stand up comedy and the only names that flash through your mind are that of male comedians our guest for today is one of india's top 3 female comedians oh wait there are only 3 very popular female comedians across the country she once said comedy is a lot like social service if someone leaves my show a little bit happier honks a little bit less my job is done humor is infectious please welcome neeti palta Give it up for Neeti Palta, all the way from Delhi. Hello. I really, really love North Indian men. See, they are so easy to please. I swear, sometimes you brush up against them accidentally, they'll go, "Hi, hi, Maza, how are you?" arranged marriages are right when the boy's family falls in love with the girl's family and they live happily ever after <laughs> hello Hi. welcome to the show neeti <laughs> sorry 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 she said it was awkward no it wasn't <clears throat> so tell us you were in advertising yes how did you get into comedy well from advertising i jumped to writing for television okay belly girl simpson And uh, then I happened to be watching this show. You remember whose line is it? Anyway? Yeah, yeah, yeah. So I'd gone for this show at Moria, okay. and um, Colin Murphy and Brad Sherwood were there. Okay. And they had this. You know how they take uh, audience participation for different rounds. Yeah, There was yeah. one round where uh, one guy is playing out a situation for the other, and they take two members from the audience to kind of come up on stage and do sound effects. and um, brad was trying to tell him about whatever spanish bull fighting mm. and i was providing sound effects it's like mm. i open my car door so i went eh <laughs> and he was like first i must oil my car door so he was getting laughs out huh. of the sound effects yeah, i was yeah. providing yeah. and uh, so i decided chalo pange lete let's see how improv their comedy really is so randomly i started going <laughs> so he like oh i must also feed my chihuahua and so i was just going crazy with the sound effects so when that round finished and there was like a lot of appreciation from the crowd and stuff colin actually turned to like this 600 seater and told them look we never take women for this yeah. because women tend to hold the mic and go <laughs> and just not do anything yeah yeah so he, he was like you know but you and he kept saying but you and yeah. in the middle of other rounds also so i think that moment i decided i should try something like Why this okay. you know this right wikipedia says this that india has the highest number of illiterates in the world i genuinely think this is bullshit because these surveys have obviously never been to our parks and monuments are every bagger can write his name santos some are so educated full sentence santos loves susila pappu loves sweety Female comedians in India have to literally fight to break the barrier. <laughs> How have you survived for such a long time? Meri comedy ka raaj raaj hai ek ek khas cream jo epithelial layer pe lagai hai to wo andaroon andar ja ke andar se aapki skin ko karti hai thick aur mazboot aur insult proof. Ye hai meri comedy ka raaj. <laughs> But genuinely, I <laughs> yeah. It's funny because I never really thought ki uh, to be a comedian the qualifying factor has to be that I have to be a man. Huh. And so mere ko kisi ne bataya nahi ki ye role ke khilaf tha. So I started comedy and um, yeah I sometimes even now when they introducing me on stage I get this 
look that we would give if we saw like an alien doing a backstroke through this pond or something. But it's fun and uh, there are a lot of pros and cons to being a female of comedian. Course. Sometimes you do get noticed because you're a female comedian and sometimes you don't get noticed in a good way because you're a female comedian. But uh, in fact, recently I got an offer for a gig and hmm. this guy was like, Handi, uh, comedian chahiye aur uh, aap na dikhne mein theek tha ke to aap na MC bhi kar lena event. <laughs> so I was like, yeah, that's not sexist at all. Yeah. <laughs> Usko samaj hi nahi hai. I have a friend who actually says, don't take advantage of the fact that you're a woman, okay? I'm like, why? Somebody has to. <laughs> Might as well be me, right? But I have a feminist friend who gets mad and I get mad too. Ladies, don't we all get mad at those Dio spray ads? <laughs> the male Dio spray ads. They spray on a little Dio spray and everybody's like, Because <laughs> in your case, you'd probably only attract a puppy or something like that. <laughs> so, but my friend is like, you know, what is all this? Yeah, why is it always the skinny women breaking down the door and coming at the man? Where are the fat women at? <laughs> Don't fat women have a sense of smell? I'm like, are they? They're just taking their time getting there. You have written for uh, Gali Gali Sim Sim. You've also scripted O Teri, the movie. You are a part of a lot of groups across the board. You also came up with Managemental with Amit Tandon recently. Ah, right. And uh, I've obviously seen you perform with, at Improv Premier League with uh, Nishant and Zakir. How do you juggle so much? I'm a woman, we multitask. <laughs> but yeah, it's a kira and the kira is never shant. So you keep trying out your hands at different things. Uh, the movie script happened purely because I was working with this director. Okay. Um, who I used to work with in Gali Gali Sim Sim. And okay. we were just chatting over coffee and we decided, Ki yaar, movie try movie. And uh -huh. that is something I hadn't tried my hand at. And literally over coffee that movie script came out. Oh really? Yeah, and then scripting it of course was the harder bit. Huh. But uh, I, w I just feel I've been very lucky with that movie because I was a nobody. I had no my bap in Bollywood. Mm -hmm. And we just pitched it to Pulkit and next thing he's like, I must talk to my mentor about it. I'm okay. like, oh, no mentor? He's huh. like, Salman Khan. So I shirt and we were on the sets of Ekta Tiger and okay. uh, they're shooting that song, Mashallah or Mashab, whatever. Okay, and okay. Salman's listening to the movie screenplay between, it was just unreal. For me, it was completely unreal. I still okay. can't believe it happened. Huh. So yeah, that's how O Teri happened. Huh. Improv happened because we figured there's, if we are comedians, we have to be funny on the spot. Let's figure out how funny we are on the spot. Of course. So we just kept watching a lot of, uh, in fact, whose line is it, clips huh. and uh, tried out a couple of rounds. And it's just that the chemistry kind of clicked. And so, improv's doing well. You guys watch CID, right? Kuch garbada hai, exactly. But they've, they've messed up on a fundamental level. They have that ACP Pradyuman. They have that guy who breaks down doors just because he's got unresolved childhood issues on being given a girl's name, Taya. <laughs> they should have a woman in the lead. We are natural CID officers. Any married man will tell you, we have a natural instinct to know when a man is messing up. More importantly, you know, we, the crime will never happen again because we will not only catch the criminal and punish him, we will insist on talking about it. <laughs> okay, girls, what are we told if we don't know the boy, what should we call him? Bhaiya. See, <laughs> exactly. Honeymoon is really awkward for us, man. <laughs> People who uh, witnessed a Punjabi wedding, give me a cheer. Right? Like, weddings are to Punjabis what the full moon is to werewolves. Man, there's so much glitter, shitter, lighty shite at our weddings. I swear to God, one of these days, a plane is going to mistake it for an airport runway and come from. <laughs> Tell us a bit about yourself, where you come from. Give us a background. I'm a foggy brat. Okay. Uh, dad was in the army. I've grown up all over India. And that's why I think poor force, I just became an extrovert. Okay. Because if you're up and about every one year, you have to make new friends. And uh, 
being a foggy kid, he, I, <laughs> इतना स्टीरियोटाइप जरूर है ही डज ना बुशी मुस्टाश ही डजन वॉक अराउंड विद अ गन इन इज हैंड एंड गो हुई हुई एवरी टाइम ही सीज दैट इन बॉलीवुड इज लाइक ऐसा मत करना बट जनरल साहब का ये जरूर था ही यूज टू थ्रो मी आउट एट सिक्स इन द मॉर्निंग ओके एवरी डे ओके ड्यूरिंग समर ब्रेक थ्रो मी आउट एंड यूज टू से भागो ओके Inevitably, brother and I would go to the nearby park hmm. and we'd pass out. Okay. And कोई ना कोई आके बताता था सा कौन सा आप general साहब whatever he was हाँ. at that point आपके हाँ. वो दो बच्चे पड़े हुए थे <laughs> so he was like whenever we'd come back with grass in our hair and all he used to think कि मतलब कुछ खेले हैं हाँ. कि हाँ. that day he realized कि ये park bench पे सो के आते हैं उसके बाद से उन्होंने घर के सामने एक बैडमिंटन को लगाया ओके नेट and he used to make us <laughs> play badminton play badminton at six in the morning. and of course the time my grandfather used to come and visit us yeah. during summer break daddy didn't even have to wake us up because dada ji na wo bhajan lagate the loudly to so, bhaiya aur main khud uth ke bhag jate <laughs> <laughs> in fact i credit my brother with me becoming a stand up comedian finally because i think he's possibly the first guy I ever offended in my life repeatedly <laughs> honestly are yaar painful elder brother बहुत मारता था मेरे को एंड सो आई एड वेट फॉर हिम टू गेट इन टू द लू ओके ही शट द लू का दरवाज़ा एंड आई वुड हैव रिटर्न वन पोएम ओके लाइक फोर लाइन्स राइमिंग लिमरिक एंड विच वर नॉट वेरी फ्लैटरिंग टू हिम एंड आई स्टैंड आउटसाइड द डोर एंड आई रीड आउट दैट पोएम एंड देन रन लाइक क्रेजी द मोमेंट आई डियर द फ्लश आई वुड रन लाइक क्रेजी सो <laughs> I have a talent for earning my bruises. I remember in college I wanted to hang out with my friends go to Shimla for a trip. My parents said no. I sulked. That's where it should have ended. Par nahi. Uske baad anywhere else I messed up. You know kuch bhi hota tha. Kamre ki light band kar rahi nahi aati. Shimla jayegi. <laughs> Tuesday ko non-veg choda nahi jata. Shimla jayegi. <laughs> And I'm a Fauji's kid, okay? And I remember there was some woo Fauji kids in the audience. Awesome. So you remember at some point there was some tension at the border. My dad was going there. Mummy was worried, and my dad is trying to make her feel better. The only way a Fauji man would. Don't worry, darling. I will call you from Lahore. <laughs> and I'm like, le, mummy se jeeta nahi jata. Pakistan haraoge. <laughs> solutions in your culture like people say traffic is a problem nobody stops at signals i'm like why are you wasting money on signals use your superstitions hire a bunch of kali billi leave them on the road everybody will stop <laughs> people say rash overtaking is a problem i'm like bhai put a sticker behind every car this car is a manglik 